think she's legit. It's so funny because Aspen Gold has been like reacting to this story. So now when people cover this story to like debunk or like prove themselves, they like use his clips as like like inception. When we're watching, we're watching how she faked everything. So there is this streamer, uh, Queen Pon something, Ponsalot or something. And she did blindfolded boss fight challenge. Fighting the hardest boss or one of the hardest bosses uh in Monster Hunter World or Rise. I don't know which one. She did it. And then people will start saying that she faked it. And then she did it again to prove herself to be legitimate. And then apparently she faked the second one as well. I don't know. So I wanted to watch it. It's something I will watch anyway. Queen wasn't so we'll bullying. She's um, legit. It's really long though. So we don't gotta watch it all if it's not good or not interesting. But he's been following this story a lot, so he's just like, he's just been like, it's real, it's not real, it's real. I don't know. I don't know, man. <laughs> At this man. point, it's like, yeah, you'll know. Actually, that's kind of Hello, you absolute legend. I thought she was really war. cool. War never changes. And neither does pretending to play a video game blindfolded for clown. And I'm like, oh, it's she's actually cool. And I'm like, what? And 60% of the time, cool. it works every time. In theory, it's the perfect plan. First, cover your eyes with a thin sheet of material. Thin uh -huh. being the key word. I can't stress enough that if the material is too thick, you won't be able to see, which will make it very hard to play the game. Yeah, then, yeah, and then it'd be like you were blindfolded, so you, yeah, you wouldn't be able to do it. And you pretend to do something that otherwise wouldn't take much skill. For example, beat Super Mario 64 or beat one relatively difficult boss. Yeah. Once completed, and this step is also quite critical, pretend to act surprised. You really want to milk this part as much as possible. Talk about how much you can't believe it and how nervous you are. Finally, post but a clip of your achievement the to the sun. of this, it looked legitimate. She even like covered her monitor with like a thick paper and then put a camera on the monitor to show that she can't see the monitor. Subreddit of a popular streamer. Prefer Probably one who doesn't know much about blindfolded runs and wouldn't immediately know it's obviously fake. If you're lucky, they'll watch it on stream. Yep. And if your plan has come this far, congratulations. You're now internet famous. Your feet will go down in- I I'm ready. I'm ready to look like an idiot. I am. If she got me on this, if there's something I'm not aware of, I want to know what it is. I'm impressed. I rarely I get got. An energy drain but well. if I get got, I mean, I'm, I'm like, yummy. Instead that impresses me. Simply turn your chat away from History the as one of the all time greats. However, I must uh, warn you, this plan comes with great risk. If your fake like, run gets oh, too popular, it Is may be seen by someone who actually right? knows a thing like or two about blindfolded speedrunning. And if this happens, you're absolutely screwed. Now, you're internet famous for a different reason. Uh -huh. And before you know it, obscure speedrunning channels are making videos about you, racking up millions of views. Today, we will be looking at the streamer Queen Pones a lot, who recently faked a blindfolded takedown of the dragon Alatreon. In the game, Monster Hunter World. Unfortunately for Queen Pones a lot, she didn't do her research, because what she produced was one of the most unrealistic fakes I've ever seen. In today's video, we are going to take a look at her run, and I'll explain why it's fake. And if you've never tried to do a blindfolded run before, you'd probably miss this one crucial detail that makes her gameplay simply impossible. And while you're okay. here, please do me a favor and subscribe. I am dangerously hmm. close to a million subs, and it would mean a lot. I really hope you enjoy. This if you want to know this what boss like five thousand almost yeah over four thousand times if you kill something that many times you know billy you, mitchell you, is you up know to the pattern of it. you should subscribe to this guy but i've watched about 15 of his videos about billy mitchell i keep up with this shit. i think it's so fucking You're funny right away. No. now legends it was valentine's day yesterday so naturally me and my lovely wife went out for dinner Anyone who knows me knows I like to have a drink, so of course I decided to wet my whistle. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to feel miserable the next day though, which is why I started the night with today's video sponsor, Zbiotics. 
Zbiotics pre-alcohol probiotic is the world's first genetically engineered probiotic. It was invented by a PhD scientist reason they'll refund your money, no questions asked. Again, just click the link in the description and use code CarlJobs for 15% off. Drinking. Okay. <laughs> Trying to convincingly fake a blindfolded now, if run of- as long as the full thing, you actually get exposure. Anything is extremely Young difficult. Men, like, Until you actually too. sit down for hours trying to do something without looking, it's almost no, impossible to flags? truly understand the hurdles and problems. I know, here we are all maidenless. I shall depart. No! To My man loved me today. I'm going to face. Sure. This is why when someone does pretend to play without looking, it's usually immediately apparent it's not legitimate. People who don't do enough research into blindfolded runs, or who haven't really spent a lot of time doing them, don't know what is or isn't possible, and they don't know what is or isn't reasonable. Yeah. One trap people can easily fall into is assuming that if you've practiced something a lot in general, that means you might be able to do it blindfolded. That's what I thought. But this is far from true. Ask any world class Last speedrunner, and they will tell you that it doesn't matter how much you practice something with your eyes open, doing it blind is a totally different beast. The streamer we are looking at today, Queen Pones a lot, didn't understand this concept. When it comes to the game Monster Hunter, she's an expert, and she's especially yeah. good at battling the monster Alatreon, which is one of the hardest fights in the game. She has killed it over 4,500 times, times, and she even calls herself the Alatreon Queen. She's definitely skilled at this fight, and she assumed that because she's good at this fight, it's plausible that she could do it blindfolded. Sure. And if she did do it blindfolded, that'd be really cool. Yeah, it would be Difficult crazy. gaming feats can get a huge amount of attention on YouTube or Reddit, yeah. so there is definitely a lot of incentive to do them the 12th of January would be the day it happened. Queen Ponzalot had been practicing, and she was ready I to blow the boss. world away. I really now, I'm going to give you a huge spoiler warning. If you don't want to know how this story ends, please stop watching now. But the well, big what do you mean? I thought we already know how it ends, because it says it, it's a title. It says she faked it. Yeah, because I already thought we knew how it happened, because it was, like, fake. Night Shyamalan twist is that she can actually see through her blindfold. Oh. I mean, even we can see through her blindfold oh. when she puts it on or takes it off. What? I didn't notice that. Blindfold. Oh. I mean, even we. Yeah, like over here. We can see it's through her yours. blindfold when she puts it on or takes it off. We can quite literally see straight through it. Oh. This it's like a nylon. This is why whenever you go to fake blindfold yeah, sure. school, they teach you on day one never to put a light source directly behind you. Yeah, when I she puts the blindfold that. on, she does it very carefully, making sure that there is only one thin layer of fabric between her eyes and the monitor. You can that's even a, prove this to yourself. That's that's a good that's a good point. That that's a very, a good very point. good point. Oh no. And you know, like I you said You can't see it, but hold on. So when she stretches very carefully, it here making a little sure bit, that there is here, you can kind of see it lighter. If it's, if it's, if you can see this much already, you could see through. If hold on, she does it very carefully, she, it making sure that there thin. is only one thin layer of fabric between her eyes and the monitor. You can that's even a, prove this to yourself. Oh, my model's there. <laughs> my model's there, in the way. Here. Fabric the blind teach you one day they see straight through it. You see, is that she can actually see through her blindfold. Oh. I mean, even you see here, <laughs> it's very thin. And then the way she puts it on, we can see through her blindfold when she puts it on or it takes it so off. We can quite thin. literally see straight and through it. it. This is why, so whenever you carefully. go to fake blindfold yeah, sure. school, they teach you on day one never to put a light source directly behind you. Yeah, when she puts the that. blindfold on, she does it very carefully, yeah. making sure that there is only and one thin layer of fabric it. between her eyes and the. When she folds it, she makes sure that it only goes right here on her nose. It doesn't double layer up. I wouldn't notice it, Laya, but it's so clear. Yeah. I didn't notice it either. Until just now. <laughs> and I've been watching, like, the... The first... I watched the... The... Initial post of her doing it blind, and I'm like, Ooh! What a cool gamer, girl! And then... Um... And then people were saying that she did a fake, and I'm like... Mm, like, I don't know. I'm like, I, I don't know. And she did it. She did a combat with the second run, and I'm like... Let's go! But, I don't know. Maybe even the second one. I don't know how he's gonna point out the second one, because I did see the second one when she covers her eyes. It's super... 
thick. She even puts like a flashlight behind it to show, so I don't know how he's gonna prove that one. The monitor. You can that's even a, prove this to yourself. That's that's a good that's a good point. That's a very, very good point. Is he not one being cute? And you I know, like I said my, that whenever I first I saw the, the first debunking video, I was like, listen, there's probably a good chance that like she could have seen something through it, right? Where I did all the lines and everything. Uh, if it was extra moth. Oh. Ooh, I, I don't, I'm never playing Monster Hunter to know. If I play Monster Hunter, it'll probably be the new one that's coming out next year, maybe. By pulling your shirt over your eyes, like and you'll see that you cool can easily see bosses. straight Talks through about it. You. Before she oh, even starts so. playing, we already know this is fake. Her gameplay, however, is so unrealistic, it's shocking that anyone ever took this seriously. Queen Pones a lot is a comic book superhero. She is the living incarnation of the Marvel character, Daredevil. Mm -hmm. Just by sound alone, she knows exactly where Alatreon is at all times. And going further, not only does she know where Alatreon is, she knows exactly where its head is. Normally, in blindfolded runs, people will use the lock-on feature to face enemies. Yeah, With sure. lock-on, the game automatically faces you to Towards the monster, so it eliminates all of the guesswork. And honestly, with lock on, Alatreon isn't a hard fight to do blindfolded. It's been done before. But Queen Pones a lot doesn't use lock on at all. Instead, she just free balls the entire fight. There's a good reason she doesn't use lock on actually, and that's because if she used the automatic aiming function, she wouldn't be able to target Alatreon's head. And she needs to hit the head in order to do enough damage with the weapon and strategy she's using. Queen Pones a lot claims that by using directional sound, she can locate the position of the dragon. And it's true that humans can determine the general direction a sound comes from, and even to an extent, the distance. But there is a reason Daredevil is a superhero with his ability to locate things using sound. It's because humans can't do that effectively or reliably. We aren't bats or dolphins. When it comes to blindfolded gaming, this has been tried and tested for decades. It's simply not possible and no one can do it. Blindfolded gamers do not rely upon sound in this way. They always use consistent setups or automatic aiming functions. It would be difficult enough using real sound in the real world, let alone the less precise inputs from a video game played through headphones. And yet what's super interesting is that the true extent of just how unfeasible this task is will be lost on 99% of viewers. Many people instinctively know that humans can't pinpoint things using sound in this way. But they do know that it's theoretically possible possible to have some idea about what's going on we know that yeah if i mean like I, I i didn't really know i mean there's sometimes like if you if i was playing PUBG and you would hear a guy you'd know pretty much where he's at so i figured if you heard four thousand guys you'd have a pretty good idea where he is we hear something in our left ear more than our right ear, uh -huh. we know the sound is coming from the left. Yeah. So when we watch this gameplay, it obviously looks unrealistic, but we can understand why someone might think it's possible to do. Mm -hmm. But there is something far more egregious going on here in this gameplay. It's like we only have left and right basically for like game sound. It's like, oh, it's coming from the right or left. That's all you know. You don't know exactly how much left or how much right. ...that almost everyone will miss, and What's it's that? hidden in plain sight. While everyone is debating the feasibility of locating where the monster is using sound, Queen Ponzalot is doing something far more impossible that you probably didn't even consider. I'm going to show you some clips and try to identify what the problem is. I've selected some extreme examples here to highlight what's going on, but it's important to know that Queen Pones a lot is doing this constantly at all times, to some extent, probably without even realizing it. In the clips I showed, she entered the menu to use an item, and in doing what? so, accidentally oh, tilted the camera that. to face upwards. She doesn't always tilt the camera when using items, but in these particular cases, she did. Immediately after exiting the menu, she fixes the camera, moving it back to a more neutral position. Mm -hmm. This isn't something that is specific to her blindfolded hey, runs either. Back. This is a habit that she has even uh, when she you, Cam is always on the monster. Yeah, that was another thing. Can see. It's 
Oh my gosh, I almost knocked my cereal out. <laughs> Muscle memory. Muscle memory? Maybe it's muscle memory. Yeah, maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's muscle memory, guys. That's right. So habitual that she kept doing it blindfolded, not realizing that you need to see in order to know you've done this. This is a problem. Because there is no reliable audio cue that tells you where you're facing on the vertical axis. <laughs> Why did she know she was facing up? How did she know how much she was facing up? How did she fix her camera perfectly and so quickly? How was she able to do this over and over and over again? The fact that you can't tell whether you're looking up or down actually ends up being a bigger problem than locating the enemy on the horizontal axis. There is no reason or mechanism that explains why she's able to keep the camera in a neutral vertical position the entire fight. You can easily test this yourself. Jump into a game and close your eyes. Then randomly scramble the camera position. Then try to use the audio cues to get your vertical alignment back to neutral. Open your eyes and see how close you were. You'll find that you can't do this reliably, if at all. True. If you do manage to do this 1,000 times in a row, like Queen Pones a lot, congratulations, you are a literal yeah. superhero. Again, yeah, I could assume maybe I could do it right once. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing, right? But, yeah, also, even though she's good at keeping it neutral, like, how does she not ever not be in neutral? <laughs> it's like from the start to finish, it's like perfect uh, placement of like, it's not too high, it's not too low. It's like perfect. Is that I could do it right once, it's maybe, ideal. maybe twice, but the thousand, that's a lot. This is a problem that has been faced before, and anyone who that's has or will ever try to do this will always end up looking at the floor or looking straight up. Yeah, there that is that a way to I'll center the camera this. and put it back to neutral by pressing a button, similar to pressing Z in Ocarina of Time, but oh, yeah. Queen Pones a lot never the uses the this, camera. and always moves the camera with her mouse. I'm guessing she was so focused on trying to make her horizontal movement believable that she never even considered the vertical movement and just did it without thinking, but it's mm. flat out impossible. The irony is that when using the greatsword, looking up or down achieves nothing. It doesn't let you hit higher, and it doesn't change your weapon range. Uh -huh. The only reason to keep the camera in a neutral position would be to keep the enemy on screen, which is pointless if you're blindfolded. If you were interested in keeping the camera in a neutral position, you can simply turn off the ability to look up or down in the game setting, True. which is yeah. probably a good idea if you're running this blindfolded. Be, yeah, but of course, yeah, Queen do Pines that? a lot doesn't do this, huh. and to just magically yeah that would have worked yeah holy shit oh, I never even thought of that. that's true knows where she is looking point. at all times after she did her solo effort about a week later she would don the blindfold again and this time yeah see that's the thing is like i i could have easily said that the blindfold on the first one she was able to kind of see through it you know like yeah for sure i i, I would concede that absolutely but I mean, the video's not over yet, and there have been some other examples too, you know? Didn't she do a... Yeah, she did. This is only about the second, the first run. We haven't seen the second run yet. Beat Alatreon in a 4v1 group attempt. This one didn't go up on her YouTube channel mm -hmm. and wasn't shared around, okay. so you probably didn't hear about it. But it's even more insane. Now she has three other team members all making sounds too, but she's sure. able to perfectly distinguish the dragon's sounds and know its location without any problems. Her hearing is so good, in fact, that she can even tell who the dragon is targeting with its attacks. Take this sequence, for example. She expertly dodges this attack when Alatreon swipes at her, an attack that doesn't even have a sound cue you can use to know it's coming. But when it turns to attack the other players, she doesn't dodge at all and even knows where the attack is going. She follows it per- Oh, oh that's bad. I think that's pretty bad. <laughs> so she can tell. So she's taking sound as a cue to dodge or not, and she can tell which sound is attacking her Perfectly and which with her camera one is as not. it's happening. She's good, man. That's she's real good. Pretty... And she can even play like this with other monsters too. Pretty so this sad. isn't just her being really good with Alatreon. Teostra. She can do this against any opponent. She legitimately a has a superpower, sucker. and scientists need to study this woman's hearing as soon as possible. 
On the 2nd of February, Queen Ponzalot posted the clip of her first Alatrae on blind. Wait, so there's no way that, like, are you telling me this girl puts on a fake blindfold to impress the viewers in her chat on a regular basis? I mean, that seems crazy. <laughs> chat, I have a friend that's watched this and all the vids and still thinks that he's legit. And that anyone thinks he's, she's lying is a shill and an incel? Dude. I love this. I think this is amazing. I, like, am I the only person... Oh boy. Like, this is, this is amazing to me. ...folded Victory to her YouTube channel. A couple of days later, one of her fans posted it to the Asmongold subreddit, <laughs> oh. at which time one of her Discord moderators tagged everyone in her Discord, telling them to upvote the post. This message is amazing. Attention wait, 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 who's this guy in my chat? ...in everyone. This so is I want to see what he's saying in my chat call to arms. Our queen needs you to go and upvote the video so what? that Asmongold watches it. Comment on it. Sing oh her gosh. praises. What? Show her how much we support her. There will be many who doubt no her way. legitimacy, but her army watched her make history live. Oh Do my... your queen proud. Comment, oh my like, God. share, and... I think he feels like... <laughs> we were all just on the palm of our hands. Everyone's just on our on her this on her on her playing like board. <laughs> and we're just all used. He watched it, it was all planned. Internet watched it because she knew that through him we'll all watch it. She had <laughs> raise her funny. up. This is huge. Queen's army, we march on. Shock no. I say she is completely based and she got so many people to believe in something that obvious. Oh fucking way. Oh my god, this is amazing. It wasn't destiny, it was like craft it was crafting. <laughs> this worked. And Asmongold did It's not that shocking. Asmongold okay. thought that he had choice in watching this, and he didn't! That's crazy. Okay. Alright, Carl, listen. I know what's going to play well and what's not. I heard this shit happened and the girl did it. I'm going to watch it whether it's fake or not. Because I think it's 100 still, fucking percent, I wish people it was are going to love it. it or they're going to hate it. They're going to have an opinion. <laughs> One way or another. This is a no-lose situation. Yes, yeah. To be fair, though, and I don't want to be yeah. dishonest here, okay? We're not going to be dishonest. I thought it was real. I thought it was real too. I think I the first one I wanted to believe it's real. It looked cool. The second time and then when that got debunked, I was like, oh bummer. And then when she did the the rebuttal, I thought that was actually real real. Either way she did good I mean either way she's a she 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 does the fight well. <laughs> she likes the game, she enjoys it a lot enough to spend time Beating it for over 4k. If you have a game you enjoy that much, that's a W. Like, I don't want to act like, oh, I was just doing this for my own intent, and I knew it was fake all along. No, no. If I got Everybody. God, then I got God. 100%. <laughs> Is that the game but for I you? It's sad, though, because she definitely is good enough to learn. Yeah, if she wanted to. I think so, too. If she wanted to, she could have done it. Actually, it would have been so cool. But me, I did also. What's another? This is a, that's why I clicked on it, right? There's a lot of videos people linked to me. I clicked on this one. But whenever I watched it, I did believe it. Okay, here we go. In fact, watch it on stream and I even did. posted a vod of his reaction to his YouTube channel. Imagine I that. Mean, listen, is it really? hard to believe that somebody couldn't pull this off after 4,000 kills. I bet, I bet this is real. Oh, Asmongold, you beautiful soul. You innocent, naive, ignorant, beautiful soul. This- Oh, I love him. Oh, God. Oh, God. I mean, he's getting complimented. He's getting complimented. If- That's like- 
One of the biggest compliments you can ever receive from somebody. Beautiful soul. This is so good. <laughs> you sweet summer child. Chad, is this real? Apparently fucking not. He's just a little fella. Ain't He's it a big cute? little fella. No fucking way. Oh my gosh, I just noticed. He has a little plushies. He's just so cute. Wow. <laughs> he added one since this time. <laughs> Ended up backfiring, as now that the clip was somewhat popular, people who actually the knew cute, how to play the yeah. game saw the clip and instantly realized it was ridiculous. Uh -huh. The gamer Juzzy would then and post I, a video. And I watched this one too. Fighting all of the ways the gameplay was obviously fake. Asmongold would then react to this video. Yes. And ultimately he concluded that maybe she could see through the blindfold. Uh-huh. I think this is what the blindfold did. I think that it obscured 95% or 90% of yep. her vision. That's right. It did not completely <laughs> obscure it, which allowed her to use the tiny little pixels that, you know, equivalent of pixel that she can see that are giving her indicators of where the boss is. So she sees the guy's arm mm -hmm. and it's like this and she knows, okay, well, then the head's going to be here. Yes. Asmongold, I think you might be onto something. Well Okay, <laughs> alright. At least I get at least I get a little bit of credit. World class blindfolded speedrunner Bubsia would also chime in, uh. also declaring that her run was faked. <laughs> Queen Pones a lot would not take these criticisms okay, lying okay. down, nor would her moderators, accusing people who doubted her as she Oh, never mind the thousands of special assignments we've helped them with, the thousands of hours we spent playing this game, the thousands of time <laughs> we killed this fucking video game dragon, post a fun video made for friends, hashtag not a speedrun. Go back and tell your buddy how cool he is. Tell him thanks for being a dick and the world's greatest incel. Get a fucking life and move out of your mother's basement. Now, do you want to talk shit or play some game? I'm like, what? Oh my god. Who is this guy? being incels who lived in their mother's basement. She uploaded a video claiming uh, that she was the victim of slander and malice. Why, why she was call adamant people names? Like, okay, if he just ended there, it would have been so much better. If he just add random to like comments like that that's totally irrelevant it just kind of <laughs> makes makes it sound like less weighted i don't know that she really was daredevil and oh really God. did possess yeah. superhuman hearing and the ability to and that's the thing minute. and that's whenever she made the follow-up video and i said to myself i was like if she fakes this i feel like that's more impressive if she fakes it i'm more impressed than if she did it because I almost never get got by shit like this. So if I get got, that I'm in fucking got. impressed. Where she's looking based on nothing. She advertised an upcoming stream where yep. she yeah, declared like she was movie. going to prove everyone wrong. When I saw this video and I saw how confident no, I hey, at least she she knows how to market. But how? <laughs> At least he, she knows how to market. I don't. And her army was in the face of these accusations. I started second guessing That's... myself. Could I everything I know about human yeah. anatomy or blindfolded yeah, gaming be wrong? Marketing Could the thousands of gamers who have dedicated it. themselves to blindfolded speedruns have missed something so simple? Maybe yeah. it was possible to just use your ears and play like normal. Maybe everyone Maybe, had yeah. been doing it wrong the entire time. Right. I... You know what's funny though? She did this where, when, when she was debunking it. She made like a trailer, and so I believe if it's not this one, like whatever video that we bought, all saying that this is fake, they did the same exact thing where they were like, they announced it in a similar style, like a movie. <laughs> I was ready to have my entire universe She's blown inspiring. to pieces. Uh -huh. Honestly, I thought she was going to back out. But just like she said, on the 14th of February, she went live. This time, she had a new blindfold. Like but before she started playing, way. she wanted to prove that the blindfold she was using before yeah. wasn't transparent. That, she used a powerful torch to show that no light was getting through. But wait a minute, this blindfold isn't the same. Oh. She's changed. It. This is what it was like before. Now it's been folded up. And you can even see the scene. Well, but she didn't use the second blind. <laughs> she, she used another blindfold that was totally different.
Yeah, no, I mean, I don't... Uh, yeah, this this could be it true. It does look significantly thicker than the flimsy material that she was covering her face ...lines with. where she has obviously sewn it together and probably sewn some kind of right. material on the inside. The uh... YouTuber Abisoft, who was there, asked her to unfold the blindfold, which is uh -huh. what it was like when she used it before, but she refused and timed him out from the chat. Even before doing this new attempt, she was gaslighting, avoiding questions, and banning people who were raising mm -hmm. legitimate concerns. It's clear as day she is a very dishonest person who this is willing to tamper with with evidence and trick people however to be fair i ban people for being accusatory and obnoxious very regularly that's fair too, i don't think that that lies. is enough to say that somebody is lying however you know it's all the other stuff too though hmm? it is the other stuff it could have also just been While a she is yeah. a dirty liar and her pants yeah. are surely on fire, she is also a magician. Her most recent attempt was amazing. Yeah, so she I went saw... on to beat Alatreon again with a proper blindfold on and with paper covering her screen. What if she had a little monitor in here? <laughs> yeah, this is the one we watched. VR has that, yeah. What if? Got him. It was so convincing that once again, the opinion of the most important person in the world, Asmongold, had been. <laughs> oh no. True. <laughs> Oh god, we gotta hear let's hear that one one more time. That once again, the opinion of the most uh. important person in the world, Asmongold, had been Oh my god. Oh my fucking no. god. I'm kinda over <laughs> Wow. Changed. But anyway, yeah, it looks like the Altrion blindfold kill was actually real. It he, did actually he's giving happen. Her the exposure. But does that mean I she don't wasn't care much cheating? For Esmond after no, it doesn't. Opinion. There were many obvious AI signs she was still cheating, and all of the issues with the vertical aiming it's, it's, still it's exist. It's not saying and that it even... actually matters. I think it's more like if he watches it, a lot of people will watch it. <clears throat> I don't know what he said about the AI stuff, but yeah, I. He's absolutely no, 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 not him kidding. The person making the video saying Asmund Gold's opinion is the most important. <laughs> like, he's obviously just kind of amplified to the extreme kidding. plus there were some really really bizarre things that were going on as well but in order to do this most recent attempt justice we are going to need an entire video because Supreme this rabbit Wanda hole is, is deep is queen pones a lot thinks she is sneaky enough to get by me <laughs> but unfortunately for her i see everything so uh oh No fucking way. So ladies and gentlemen, mark your calendars for February 29. Wait, and what? we'll no! find out if Queen Ponzalot Judge is a little Judgment superhero Day. who can do things no other human can, or if she's just oh a deceptive God. streamer lying to her fans and it's pulling Judgment off the Day. oldest trick in the book once again. Stay tuned. No. Please remember to oh, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, no, no, you no. legends. No. I hope you're having a fantastic no. day, and I will see you in the next video. Bro left us on cliffhanger. I know. I thought he was going to go over the the rerun, not that. <laughs> Dang. I think got a lot of wrong opinions in my view, but that goes for everyone. I'm sure I disagree with Namu on a lot of things. <laughs> yeah, and that's okay. But I still like Nama and their flappy ears. Thank you. Honestly, then it's all good. <laughs> we got baited. Yeah, we got baited.